Alabama 4-H Science Center proudly presents paddleboard intro and equipment. All right, boys and girls, um, we are going to quickly go over how we are going to get ready for our paddle boarding class. So we're going to get ready at the same site as the canoeing class. All right, we've got all of our life jackets or our PFDs for short. All right, so all students need to be wearing a correctly sized PFD, which we already learned how to do in our previous class. All right, but our students are also going to need a paddle boarding paddle. All right, and these ones look a little bit different. Um, they've got um, there's this nice blue um, aisle paddles, which are pretty nifty, right? Now, these are kind of all the same size to start out with. Now, to correctly size a paddle um, for your students, the paddle should be over their head, all right? Now, um, to change the sides, the size of these paddles, they've got these clips here. You're going to push them out, all right? And then they go up and you can size appropriately from there, right? And as I mentioned before, um, you want these paddles to be above the student's head um, because they are going to be standing upright on those paddle boards, right? Now, with these paddles, same thing as before, if you're walking around with them, um, you can carry them as long as they're not touching the ground. We're still not gonna be fighting with them, all right? Um, and you want these uh, bottom paddle portions to be on your toes otherwise, all right? Sound good? So that's the first piece of equipment. The second one that all students must have is our paddle boarding leash, all right? Um, these are mandatory for all students to have, um, and CITs, you will also need one of these as well, okay? Now, we have two parts of our leash here. Um, one part is going to go around your ankle, okay? Very nifty, it's just Velcro, um, and you want it to be nice and snug, and this doesn't matter which ankle it goes on, whatever is more comfortable for you and the campers. The other portion here, which we'll show you in a second video, is going to be what you attach to the back end of that paddle board, okay? And we'll go over how to do that in a little bit. Um, but making sure every student has a leash, a paddle, and a PFD for paddle boarding, we'll be good to rock and roll. <laughs> 